What is happening guys? Welcome back to our channel. This is Nancy and Alvin and this is the, the new, new world. world and welcome. So my shout outs. <laughs> that was like we did too. Don't, don't be. Yeah, you know you. The person is supposed to go on din 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 din. For you, babe. Babe, see, as long as we're here. Anyway, guys, welcome back. This is the Lee World. Mashara, Mashara. Thank you very much for coming back, and we are back. First of all, thank you very much for supporting uh, the website launch. Yay, it's thank been amazing. You. Guys, before anything, I'm your coach for everything fitness and nutrition. So please and go to my and therapy. <laughs> You're such a nice therapist. I'm a therapist. Sometimes when you're not annoying me. Uh -huh, go to the Please website. go to my website. <laughs> link is in the, uh, in the description. Uh -huh. Choose your program. In case you want to, in case you're lost, you don't know how to choose a program, please, you can contact me just right there. Yeah. Email PA Also, in case you want coaching, coaching is also there. You can uh, easily choose Adromax Foundation or Adromax Pro, whatever it is. So let me know. I'll be there for you. Anyways, wait, let me tell them. So after this series, remember I told you last week, okay. and now we will go into the behind the scenes mm. of starting a business. Be a He's already launched his. Yeah. Mine is just about to launch, and I'm Let's nervous as hell. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll take you through the behind the scenes of everything that yeah. happened. So maybe it will inspire you yeah. to make a purchase, you know? Yeah. <laughs> so today was your last day. Uh, today is my last part of the story. Oh, yeah. the series is coming to an end. Yeah, coming. It's coming to its evenings. It's the evenings, yes. Anyway, so my story is just about campus. Remember what I went through in high school, all levels, A levels, mm -hmm. Uncle Lucky, Masharat, Masharat. Bo, 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 bo. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and uh, now it's time for campus. Uh, my father wanted me to go back to university in Uganda. Remember, they left me. I was not about that business anymore. I knew I was smart. You cannot dump me in a country and just leave me there. Don't even call. Call once in a blue moon. My dad wanted to go to body. I love body. Uh -huh. I'm not complaining. So but I gave you what you wanted. The conditions. Mazaya, you just go and dump your child there. <laughs> But they're also working. You think life is easy. <laughs> I know it wasn't easy, but Mazi just called and said, Hello, <laughs> my son, how are you doing? Okay. Anyways, <clears throat> it's, anyway, I didn't go back to Uganda because of, uh, of that. I went back, I, I, I mean, I refused to go back because of two reasons. Reason number one, I really wanted to know my country. Remember, I've been in Uganda from 97. Hmm? Yeah, to 2012, 2013, 2012. Yeah, I spent a lot of time. 98, sorry, I went to Uganda in 1998. So that's a very long time. We used to visit uh, Christmas and all that stuff, but that was it. You get so I didn't have any friend in Uganda. In I mean, Kenya. in Kenya whatsoever. And then I. And yeah. then there was drama. Remember the drama I had in O levels and A levels? The fire. I mean the rioting. Mm -mm. The that drama. The girl drama. Girl dramas follow you for the rest of your life in campus in Uganda. Uh -huh. Yeah. So I do want to go. So you wanted to and start my life afresh. In other words, <laughs> hey, yeah. Well. <laughs> Uganda, no, you don't understand. No, Ugandan ladies are so nice, but there's a problem. You're nice. It's it's a problem that's happening right now in Kenya. Mm. You're nice to a girl. She has already built the castle. <laughs> you guys are mad. I had South Africa is even worse. But anyway, that was a state in Uganda. Ugandan women are so nice, but the problem is. Maze, they're just too nice, man. So when you're too nice, <laughs> you as a man, you're also too nice. No, you are married. You're married, man, without even knowing. You're just so you friends. wanted to come here where you, you believe no, you're nice. No, no, okay. Because I'm too quick, I just wanted to start life in Kenya. I just wanted to know and my people. Beginning. That is it. I wanted something fresh. Uh, 
And so my dad really wanted me to go to Makere University, Z. Makere. Z, yeah. I like Makere. that name, Makere. Uncle Lucky actually did this in Makere. Makere. Mm. I said Z, uh, the two universities I will go for, it was either USAU or Strathmore University. Mm. And uh, my mom, my uncle, my other auntie, my cousin, we came together and we said, you know what? Let's go to Strathmore University because mm -hmm. the stories I've heard about USIU, people, people, students are getting spoiled. See, <laughs> <laughs> I was like, anyway, why, why is that the narrative? It always happens. I'm not lying. It's it's a it's a stereotype, but I don't know. Because even Strathmore, whatever people are saying, oh, serious students. <laughs> yeah, the one who knows. You don't happened. know Strathmore. Yeah. Strathmore <laughs> is like nuns in, you know, you know. We all know these people to be humble, but in real sense, nah, something different. So yeah. I went to Strathmore University. I wanted to do law. Uh, my friend, I have, I have lawyers in the family. I saw the books heaped in the houses. In the houses <laughs> and I said, Napenda father studies, like in Sipendi grandfather studies. That's a dad joke. Anyway, uh, I left. I, I, I need yourself for something. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I, 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 I refused to do law, as in, I just said no law, but I loved law. Actually, I did become. In become, we had law units, and I was very good in law units. Yes, law. The problem is, I just didn't like all that reading. It was too yeah. much. That is it. Because in B, uh, my lecture was Miss, Miss Mbaluto. Yes. Oh! Miss Maluto used to Alvin, yes, bring my table because first of all I used to work out. So I was always yeah, there to prepare her her yeah. table there, you blah, 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 everything. <laughs> Alvin, please read for us from section A to section B. Hey! I remember we let me join my first encounter with Miss Maluto. Mm. The first business law class. She had mm. these long Nails. blue nails. Nails. Yeah. And she's talking like this, so they're yeah. like all over your face. And she had an accent. Yeah. An American Say accent. Say what she did. <laughs> <laughs> you know that me I know. I know. Mr. Nice. Really miss her. <laughs> Anyways, I even don't think she remembers me. Anyways, that was uh, when I joined Strathmore. I didn't have any friends in Kenya. I had to start Ooh, building. Yeah. No, don't worry. Me, I was okay. I had to start building from scratch and I was excited about it. So, life in Strathmore, mm. aka Stressmore, that is it. You were both there. Strathmore is just Stressmore. <laughs> There's life standard stress. You're looking at both people's <laughs> children Culture show. coming Culture with cars. Show. Yeah, yeah, like, Hi. You are there with your parana legs. Yeah. Bro, babe, me, I'm the one who my dad drops Uko, those ends, then you walk. <laughs> you at least your dad didn't drop it. Me, I'm there from the Matatu. <laughs> You've packed a big ass bag because you have to carry your shoes, the official shoes, the shoes for walking, and then you change it. <laughs> okay. yeah. Your blazer because you don't want to over sweat on it. <laughs> babe, I know, eh? Strat, hey. why? <laughs> anyway, there's a lot of culture shock. So in Strathmore, I think it's the same in many universities. Mm -hmm. If you are not self-aware, you can get lost. Trust me. You'll definitely get lost because you're trying to be in levels you can't even be, you know. Uh, so I met very many p new people, people of different uh, standards of living. Uh, I remember it used to be a big deal if you had to eat in the student center and if you eat in Siwaka, which is outside school. <laughs> man, I didn't give a shit. Me, I'm eating at Siwaka, I'm eating at student center. I eat Mandazi Pasua here. I go this side, student center. The ladies know me because I love Chapo. Yani, I was eating everywhere. I miss you know? Trap, Now you see. Life was so Coming. easy. <laughs> Life was just so easy. Yeah, there's. To adult. I don't know, man. There's peer pressure in Strathmore. Uh, oh, yeah. Events. You cannot miss an event. I even I had. Uh, you're going to Vima. And I'm like, ah. You remember? I'm just. <laughs> I'm starting life in Kenya fresh, and I'm starting in first year. I'm hearing Vima. I'm like, Who is that Vima. place? I know. Vima. Vima. <laughs> no, that's how that person pronounced it. To Vima. Yeah. Uh, contest for those who don't know. Village market. Village market. That's it. Yeah. 
So now I'm like, hey, is this Vima? In my head. So I'm not acting like a villager outside. I'm like, people are going to Vima now. I'm like, I, how, how much? <laughs> 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 How much is it to go to Vima? No, we shall go to this. This guy will bring his car. We shall go. Then you shall uh, top up for drinks and eat. Me, I'm like, eh, that is too much stress. First of all, I live in Embatasi. You guys will <laughs> not drop me home. So, Z, me, I'll leave. And that is how I started choosing my battles. my battles. That's <laughs> it. I I was very unapologetic about it. If I know I can't make it or be of that lifestyle it's okay if you're going to westy at that time it was backers uh what is this other place in vineyard vineyards ah that one i'll go because hey, it's we near you see because it's near that mm. was my prime time for party yeah that is but yours. then i don't drink so i was always used to get drinks drinks and everything else and i was and the designated <laughs> driver every day every day so that was me and i never also used to drink until one day i just said no i can not just yeah i see my mom what me what's wrong <laughs> you're an adult now you're in your anyway, anyway they so tell you as long as you're under my roof <laughs> so there was a lot of that happening i wanted to join something sporty in the school so i i, I was doing before campus actually when i was in form six vacation I was playing rugby for Impala here during my vacation. I was um, waiting to start in Strathmore. But after I joined Strathmore, I turned to uh, rugby for Strathmore. Now, uh, I was, while I was rugby for Strathmore during practices, something called 6x6, six six, they make the, the field very small, like quarter. Then you guys are 6 against 6, and it's so packed. And that's where two guys need me, tackled me on opposite directions. And one guarded my eye direct, Danny. Then another guy on my back. So my back was hurting, my eye was red. And that Saturday, no, the next Saturday, I was going for my first modeling shoot. With a red eye. So my eye is red. <laughs> <laughs> That's the thing that has happened. Because I remember I was still balancing. I need to find something to make money and something I would love. The problem is modeling. Uh, shows I journey. Mm -hmm. Rugby is also journey practice. So I had to choose. One makes money. Like... One makes little money, long shot, and one makes money. Like even if it's so fifteen hundred, modeling was making money. Fifteen hundred was money to me that time. I was like, where fifteen hundred? And everything to just do like this walk, <laughs> do this, 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 and turn back. <laughs> ah, man, in. So that's what happened. So. I went to the hospital, uh, they gave me some, what do you call it, eye drops that cleared my eye before the shoot. I was so happy. So I did the yeah. shoot in Vika. Yeah. Boss, Leander. That's how I say meeting that people. Is okay. Is That's that the same day you had your talk? No, no. This story was uh, high school. Oh. So that's when I started meeting people during my auditions, modeling stuff. I used to always go to Ilo's False. I used to go to because uh, I'm an artist. That's uh, acting as a triple threat: modeling, acting, dancing. No, it's a truth. Yeah. Well. Oh. I didn't say anything. Uh, I used to go to <laughs> Kenya National. Eh, what's it? The stories of Kenya National Theatre. The story is like this. You don't have anything to do in town, <laughs> you go to Kenya National Theatre, you go, you're a, a very good student, Yanni, you know your upcoming artist, you go look for auditions, there's no audition, okay, so. <laughs> but in that process of going there, you meet other people, that's how you start becoming friends. Mm -hmm. You go for auditions, there's a, a long line, in that line, all those people in that line, that's what I those are your auditions. friends. No, wow. let me tell you. Babe, some... Auditions are so exhausting. Yes, they're very exhausting. I, I love acting, but if you could just audition on camera and send our things like that, like that. There, yeah, let me tell you what happened. They already have the actors. They just have to show the investors to look for the auditions. Mm -hmm. Now, me, I didn't know that stuff. But the friends I used to make was in the audition line. That is the real, real, yeah. real truth. Even this AJ, the one who auditioned me for, called me for the auditions for the Airtel ad. I met him on the line, my friend. 
Me and him are in the same level. Right now right is an agent, you know. Hey. Exactly. Uh, so we used to be on that. Then you see Kinanik Mutuma coming and passing, jumping that line. <laughs> For you, you have been there patiently. In the line. Ah, Nick Mutuma is watching me. Uh, he knows it's a truth. Because <laughs> there's a big fish on that side. But I was okay with it. Then when I get there, they say we shall call you back. Boss, when they you say we shall motivated. call me back. I'm like, man, they say they will call me back, man. You don't know that's the statement <coughs> they tell everyone. But until I was so okay. used, we shall call me back. Like, the first times you hear me, we shall call you back, you're the most excited mm -hmm. person. Because you watch on TV, people say we shall call you back. Like, and they are called back. And they are called back. My friend, tell me. It's a different it's story. A different story. <laughs> mm -hmm. Sana. Until I was bulletproof to that. I used to just block my feelings. I started with Eugene, my cousin, Marvin, my brother. We used to go. They all dropped off because my friend, that life is not <laughs> easy. Really there bad. is no return. You go in the morning, you live in the evening. You no, go for auditions in the morning. Yeah. By the time you figure your next uh guys, we are the auditions are done. Uh, You've been there since morning. It's now seven thirty. Yeah. Ah, they're close. Hey, you could more, you yeah, man. More. You just, hey, man. You, you're there eating jugu, laughing with people. Like, but the friendships we made are really nice. Cause they used to call you for auditions here, Sarakasi. I went for auditions for Sarakasi. The dancers. Yes, modeling. My first modeling show I got was with Jeff, Jeffrey Wilson. Oh, that guy. That's the guy who actually, boom made me start this thing you know jeffrey wilson and there's a guy called kevin mafumbo kevin mafumbo is one who took my first modeling portraits so it's okay don't worry don't worry but they gave me the first show the first show was done at secrets lounge opposite Alliance francais skitambo secrets Lounge. and me i thought as the big fish the pictures are here <laughs> <laughs> You always think you're the big fish. You don't, don't understand. It's like it's Mandela, but at least I'm starting something new. You're feeling good, eh? Um, yeah. And I kept modeling a, a secret to my parents because there was that stereotype of models are uh, this. What are they call it? Gay. I, I, I used to see the people who I used to find gay in the industry were mainly stylists, makeup artists, not the models, unless the other models I didn't know. But about um, like gigolos, like can easily go with women, older women, or sleeping around because of that stereotype. I never used to tell my parents. But the day I appeared on newspaper for a modeling show, my mom was the happiest. Then. We told I told her let's not tell my dad because we didn't know my dad's reaction. But once we told my dad, he said, "Oh, that is a do catwalk. Eh? <laughs> okay, that's good." And that was it. That is so proper. That is it. That was it. So I enjoyed my modeling days and uh, I advanced pretty pretty fast because I used to model and uh, dance on the same show and get double the pay. At this time. I started with fifteen hundred per show. This time I'm earning like fifteen thousand per show or oh, seven thousand per show. Yeah, it used to depend. Seven thousand, eight thousand per show. So if it's double, I end up with fifteen. Remember I'm in campus, my friend living your best life. Living my best life. I'm not paying rent, there's nothing. You know? What are you doing that money? Man, don't ask me. <coughs> but then I quickly realized that I needed to make money very very fast i noticed that okay struck more different life i accept those guys are rich kids i accept this is my situation uh i come from a middle class family and if you know yourself and you want to grow yourself relax this is campus everyone will come to show off life will catch up so me i was like, I, is it like that? it's like that <laughs> Such a show of opportunity. Once you leave the other, it's the other way around. Always. Let me tell you, I was the show offer. I know, show. I know. I will. I'm here to that part. <laughs> anyway, um, what was I even going to say? Uh, I was selling beads. I used to go to Masai Market, buy ladies' beads, come home. Uh, my mom and I used to try and, uh, what do you Package call it? Them. Package them all, just match, mix and match. Mm. Then after that, I used to carry them in a jeweler. At that time, jewelers are not banned. And I take them to school. I used to sell in class. I used to sell that in class. 
That was it. So what are you telling people? Do you want to buy beads? Man, me, I was not ashamed of anything. <laughs> me, I'm selling beads. <laughs> no, no, come on, no. And yeah, that's so, that you don't have an interpreter. Yeah, you buy. Can't, you can't be guy. What you like? You say? can't. <laughs> so remember, in high school, I was doing what selling my boys all levels, A levels. Uh, and selling my boys and movies, eh? Sindio, for school. Starting movie show and all that stuff. A levels kind of the same thing. Uh, uh, campus, just beads. Then I started doing personal training at that time. Yeah. Started doing personal training. Now I, I built a new routine in my life. Nights, I'm a focus student. I'm in year two. So I go. Um, my dad drops me. I used to tell my dad, drop me here at Belleville. That's from Embakasi to Belleville. So I used to tell my dad, drop me at Belleville. He never knew. I don't think if he has ever even known that all I all along I had a, a client. Because what time is class? Class starts at 8. 8. eight. Class starts at when 8. My dad is dropping me at Belleville at 5.30. It's still dark. Mm. So I drop at Belleville, walk. I got to my first client as an Indian designer called Nikusin. That was my client. His jewelry though, damn! Ah, sick. Actually, I've modeled for him, I think, thrice. What a good have to put up I'll put those what? pictures there. You'll just know that's Nikusin. Yeah. All his work is just right there. So, I've, uh, I used to go and, uh, and train him. At that time, I'm doing house calls for 6,000 book monthly. But that is low, Iliakuna, but... For me, it's passion, mm -hmm. and I'm enjoying. <laughs> You're such a good boy. <laughs> okay. Angry. So I used to train him at his rooftop uh, for I don't know for so long. I, I know that rooftop. So, yeah. yeah. So I remember it was six k, then it increased to ten k. Yeah, and I was like, happy. Yeah. I was like, oh, really? Yeah, so, so you are here making almost 25k per hour. Relax, I'm not even getting any far. <laughs> far. So I, may, I, I used to train him. After that, I leave, I walk. I used to walk from Bellevue all the way. You know, I used to now discover South Sea, Missouri. I used to come back the same, same route. Shout out to South Sea. Walk all the way till uh, that stage. There's a stage that the roundabout, I've forgotten what that roundabout is called. Nyayo. Around. Is it Nyayo? Nyayo Stadium. Yes, 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 yes. Nyayo Stadium, get a mat to start more. Then I'm in class by 8. That used to be my routine for the longest time. Mm. But now he used to refer his sister-in-law his brother-in-law mm -hmm. to me i have no time so that's when yeah. i brought to a songa and obara oh. and they give me commission hey look at you businessman my friend yeah? giving delegations <laughs> to your protege yeah but but then that's when i noticed that uh okay i need to if i'm going to make more money i need to go online i used to my benchmark was never anyone in kenya apart from leon leon Weche. The grandpa, grandpa. Ooh, that was my only benchmark in Kenya. Anyone else it used to be abroad. That time I was heavy on Snapchat. So everything how they used to market the website, I used to screenshot and I say one day when I have a website, I will market it exactly like this and make my product exactly like this. So I'm going to put a picture here. This is the first time I made my my online packaging. It's my young brother shooting my online videos with an Infinix phone. Mm. Yeah, that's how I say doing it. And I used to sell them at fifteen hundred for the program. I sold ten thousand in one week, and I knew okay. What? Now you never told me that one. So that you come and dig me. What do you mean? You Your and property dig me? is my property. I I didn't know you. By like law, that. I didn't know. Like no, now you know, but you and, have and by the way, all that you are, you are already left struck more anyway. Oh, yeah, mm. <laughs> yeah, anyway. Um, I saw Nessie before all this part of the online thing, but I was already doing uh my PT at that time. I saw Nessie, I see her on the escalators, you know, someone breathing air, so G. How she breathes nit nitrogen, she just. <laughs> hmm? What do you mean? But I used to feel her presence like, eh, that's too much. I do have a presence. Then at that, I'm like, like in energy, feel it. Eh? 
but of course, mm -hmm. no, with okay. such beauty, what do you expect? <laughs> do you expect me to be shy? I have to walk with confidence. My parents raised me different. Hey. <laughs> anyway, more of the story. Yeah. I stuck to my leg. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, I would have been stressed because I'm a too Because yeah. my friends were chicks. I used to see the dudes come to pick them with cars. <laughs> yeah? So for me, I just say, hey, it's okay. Me want a two name. Trick. Walk home, my friend. Walk home. So I had a new routine. I was doing PT. Go to school. After school, run back home. My my. My sister was in boarding school, so it was just me, my dad, my mom, and my young brother. So I ran back home, cook dinner. After cooking dinner, make sure dinner is ready for my young brother. Dinner is ready for my parents when they come home from work. I go downstairs, near your estate at that time, work out. I used to work out at the backyard. After work out, come home, shower, do assignment for the, any school work, sleep, repeat, repeat, repeat. Weekends, modeling shows, dancing shows, any auditions, repeat. That was my lifestyle for all nice. those years of, of campus. Back to back, back to back, back to back. Then after that, um, I got my first advert. Actually, I got my first advert when I gave up. I gave up on audition, up. auditions, like I can't do this anymore. Mm -hmm. It's heartbreak after heartbreak <laughs> for years. Let me tell Every you. Every day. Let me tell you how sick it was. In town, in town. First of all, I've been conned. Those are stories for another day. In town, as new, a person can just tell. In Nairobi, you've been conned. No, no one can tell you. you my friend, the stories for being conned ah, is so sweet. And you only conned once, and then they disappear. I've I've tried to con people who sell uh nini. Not really con, but a con man. relax. You jump into conclusion. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you diving? <laughs> anyway, I I was you know when you're in town mm. to leave Embakasi to town you need to leave early. Otherwise, if you're five minutes late, there'll be traffic and you'll get your meeting late mm. or auditions late. So I used to come one hour early, two hours early, and I'm in town. You have nothing in town, you don't know anyone in town. There's what you call trekking town. Sasa, you, Lazima, you know all the halls of town. So I walk. <laughs> Papa okay, like okay. you, you go down. Okay, Papa Papa. You go down to Nini. What do you call that place in town? A river <laughs> Road. <laughs> you go to River Road. You <laughs> see the Jochoro. You see prostitutes. Dead time. It's morning. Mazin, you've you already started the <laughs> job. I was like, these people are hard working. Have to work. <laughs> exactly. I was like, where? You go down river road, you go up and go up now, um, um, this side, upper side of town, uh, parliament mm. areas. I used to walk. By the time you reach auditions or your meeting, on a sweat, you're stinking. <laughs> <laughs> that is life. And remember, you're on a budget. Hmm? Every money counts. Actually, if you remain with 20 bob, now you can go to. Uh, to those at Audion, there's that place where I used to buy chipo for 20 bob with toothpick and you also have to buy 5 bob, you have to buy 5 bob uh, tomato, sauce. tomato sauce then I used to nini with my friend actually the friend I used to go with to that place became a street girl I'm not lying to you I actually never knew him very well but I, all, I think used to stay on the streets and go for auditions and he never told me he never used to let me escort him to his bus, whatever. He used to only do mine, and that was it. But later on, I noticed when he came, approached me, then I was like, this guy looks homeless. Then I gave him something. But anyway, before that, I remember we used to have conversations after auditions. If you have 20 bob left, or 10 bob with changa changa, we buy one for 20 bob, then you eat. Then in those restaurants, everyone is standing up, you're watching TV. Then I was like, the guy told me, Alvin, like, you know, Joa, one day you'll get an advert. Now, all these people have already known your face, so you stop, you have to stop <laughs> coming here. Yeah. And I stopped. And at that time, I used to use all those video choros of town. You know, that's why you the see a man. Is very, yeah, you know, very the narrow. Ones. They are smelly, and I am used to it. I don't fear. Right now, I fear. I can't grow. <laughs> and even I'm more muscle now. Yeah. Imagine. 
I never used to fail because I was just a town person. That was it. Co hustle and that was it, you know. So I got my first ad. Then I was like, wow, remember this guy telling me one day with the ad and all these people you know you and your ad will be there and people will say, hey, kumbe awali people. So it left. Uh, so I got trust advert. Uh, that advert you saw of a guy with tattoos here, blah blah, is the DJ. That was me. Uh, that advert Did that paid guy me. Ever knew you again, see you again. I saw him once after that. That was. I've never, I've not seen. Yes, I did. I bought him a uh, bakerzin. I bought him a. Uh, yes, I left him something. It's not like I was bowling, so no, But anyway, yes. Uh, the trust condom ad went well. Uh, I was paid good money. That was my first big money. Big money, you know. Plus big boy money. those, hey, hey, it was big money for me, man. <laughs> It was big money, Yanni. I even didn't take it to the bank. I kept it. I kept my socks and boxes in the house. <laughs> it's not that. You just want to Be see. Ledger. This is my hard work after I gave up yeah. auditions. So Yanni, that, you take one thousand. Yeah, time. my friend. That is how Did I cannot account know, yeah. for that money. Did your parents know? You cannot tell my mom, mom I'm sorry, but. <laughs> <laughs> but when it she saw the ad. Yeah. No, of yeah. course they are happy because. No, she didn't ask how much you're paying. Of so. course, but you have to learn how to do certain <laughs> questions. The only thing I remember I bought from that Nini was two phones. One was for my girlfriend at the time, and one was mine for business. And that one for business is what my young brother was using to it's record the videos because it had good. The Infinix. Yes, the Infinix. It had good clarity. By that money, I'm not going to lie Man, to you. I should have been in your life. We would have panga that money very well. You know, baby. No. You know very no. well. No. Nessie had to go a separate way. I had to go a separate <laughs> way. So I had to meet. If we met at the beginning, yeah, we wouldn't have lasted. We wouldn't money. have lasted, babe. I know. Why? Your lifestyle at that time, your choices at that time were different. I like good life. Exactly. I but did, that doesn't mean my I don't good know life. Let me money. tell you my good life, <laughs> you people. I used to take my girlfriend at that time to steers. <laughs> me, I order salad and I say I'm on a diet. <laughs> Regular chips. I didn't have money. But now when you got uh, the the advert money, boss, you don't have confidence of even going for a vacation. Which vacation? <laughs> Now, still in you know, it's all it's all about the that things. money you would have had no. because of you one day if gone. Yeah, but I've helped you plan. You <laughs> know that very really well. No. In fact, you'd have moved out that day. Now I believe you. Ben, I <laughs> do not trust you. I don't believe I refuse to ever even think that I would have ah, believed you. Ah my youth was fun. Youth Let me tell you, I thank God <laughs> that when I saw Nessie, I didn't bother to approach her. I would have maybe been what do you call it? I love lo, man, I had low self esteem, that's number one. Mm -hmm. No, it's the truth. I had. No, you have. High so, hey, me, I'm okay. As in self, you no, know, you have to be self aware, you know. <laughs> the life I've gone through in Boutique eh, taught me life <laughs> to appreciate life the way it comes. So, when okay. I come here, I'm like, hey, Apple, don't even try. Me, I create my land, I build my land. If you want to join my land, please come to my land. That's how I live my life. So you to to date! I'm the one who came to your lane. That's what you're trying to My make friend, simple. can I make it simple? Uh, that's what you're trying you to do. You left to Karen, came to my lane in Jammu. <laughs> so tell me if you're, you're not in my you lane. Came <laughs> you came hunting in Karen to where oh, I was. Leave me alone. You took me to Jammu. No. So don't say I'm the one who joined your lane. You came anyway, looking for me. Anyway, lane. the goal is this. No, you have to accept you <laughs> looking for my Sour. Man, that is how you have peace. Whether they are Thank wrong you. or right, just say I know right. He knows he's right in his heart. The point is this, guys. Uh -huh. You have to be focused in life. Know what you want. But if you know that a certain direction is going to slow you down or not take it, rather accept, know where you are in life, continue moving on. Don't try to fast and make that rest fast. Ah, baby steps. Stay focused. So for me, I knew if I went to Nessie's side at the beginning, I would have lost myself. It's the truth. If you're making people think that I'm such a babe, zipper. there is no way I can sugarcoat it. Do you know your life in campus? It was just fun. That's it. exactly 
For what we does fun like require? Fun for, oh no, my God, hold we are on, talking, hold on. No? What does fun require? A little bit of money. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, I had not a little bit. That's a darker. <laughs> Exactly, and for me, I was not there, so it was good you had to learn all that to come yeah, and appreciate me. I'm not going to lie. Yeah. I also it. enjoyed my, my, my campus, I enjoyed my hustle because my job was fun. Modeling, we went to Watamu for a weekend. My friend, that was my life. life. Yes, that was my best life. We went to Sawela Lodge for modeling, and we, and, and we slept there. My friend, it was fun, and I'm modeling, and I'm being paid. It was called vacations. Actually, most of my hustles in campus and after campus were all vacations. Vacations? Yes. Okay. You live there with a nice 15, 20 Gs, plus you've had fun, everything is on the house. What are you talking That's, about? That sounds fun. Yes, it was fun. Anyway, um, by the way, I just have to bring this very fast. There's something I learned even deeper. It's called time management. My dad used to drop me to school, so he's doing a very big favor that he's dropping you where to school. So you see that guy putting Not on his school. socks somewhere around. Okay, school. around school. <laughs> so you can see him putting on his socks. They're like, and dad will take two minutes put on his socks. You look like this. You look back. You hear? <laughs> he has left. That has superpowers. And <laughs> he has gone. Oh, sometimes you just say, "Kto." The door's gone. What? <laughs> and then like jumping off the window. I carry my bag, everything. It's very early. It's dark. It's then dark. my dad is seeing me in the same mirror. I'm running. <laughs> stop, stop. That guy is like. <laughs> I'm doing a very big favor. The guy has gone. He's going. He has gone. So I have to now look into my pocket. Any money I have to go to school. Panda yeah, man. Panda Mat. And you go to school. My dad <laughs> did that all the time. Actually, he did that to me. I'm his son. He has done that to his very friend. I've seen it like, uh, I told this guy to come stand here at this time. Where is he? Uh, then he leaves. <laughs> he has gone. <laughs> and that is... <laughs> time keeping with that. Hi, yeah, yeah. Young yeah, ladies, <laughs> well for talking. And I think you become like that. But you need to relax a bit. Nah, you have to give time. someone like a five minutes. Just in case they went to the toilet. Let me tell you, I'll only accept you to be late, but communicate earlier. I'm not talking about communication of I'm supposed to meet at eleven. You're communicating at eleven. Communicate at eleven at ten thirty. And say I'm say oh I'm going to yes <laughs> communicate okay, it, please okay. and then usiniambe niko karibu and you're just leaving. <laughs> A perfect like you said effective communication. Thank you very much. Anyway, so I was very intentional with uh, my friends, the people who are my friends, I was very intentional with them, uh, very intentional with my time and very intentional with what I did. Because me, I was focused, I knew my goal. I, if I cannot afford a certain lifestyle, my friend, I will make money to afford it. I live within my means, okay? Then, yeah, that was it. I moved out of home after campus my mom still thinks i left mad i didn't really leave mad I, I was i just could not grow in my parents house as a man like why what was happening okay Let's talk about it. for example madam this is madam. a therapy session <laughs> for example <laughs> first of all i used to go okay my parents got got used to this or do i mean any show for modeling can start at around 10. I've been in town at all wee hours of the night. Mm -hmm. All of them and reached home at all wee hours. I'm not going to keep coming at my parents' house in the morning and all that stuff. And I'm not from clubbing. Mm -hmm. It's just that it's the truth. The show ended at 2 mm -hmm. or whatever. And then you have to wait for your payment. You know, useless stuff, by the way. Useless time wasting. Mm -hmm. The show starts at 10. Models, you are required to come here at 5 p.m. 5 p.m. till 10. My thing, I understand those guys. Okay, also, I get it because people come. Yes, yeah. yes, I get it. But what and I'm saying. You do makeup, fitting. Exactly. And all that but thing. the point is, it used to be a lot of time missing, even after the show. After the show, people okay. just want to go home. Mm -hmm. You get. And then there are certain things you can't do in your parents' house. Like what? Bring a girl from over. What are you bringing girls over for? 
For vetting. You're supposed to be living a pure life. Pure. My friend, God told us, come. <laughs> Explore this world. <laughs> Daughters. No, anyway, it's not that he about bring a girl home. As in, you know the freedom. You know what I'm talking about. There's no freedom at home, and I needed freedom of growth for myself. Like, you come home, you have to do chores. By the in my mother's house, whether you are male or female, I'm <laughs> Aphrodite. Lazima <laughs> ufanye chores. Hmm? Now for you me, must. my family, the flip is the flip side. The women do the chores, the men chill. I could not stand, stand it. Stand it. Now, this is lucky what? for me. I'm used to chores. Let me tell you how. That is why I married you. You think it was because of your good looks? Oh, so it is just I chores. I married you to help me with the chores. We balance and we counter this traditionalist that I was brought up in. <laughs> you know? And there are very many people. Even there are some girls' houses I used to visit. I go and wash the place. They're like, no! Don't wash, don't even come here. I'm like, what? Nah, and you know, it's really different, watch. it's different upbringings because that's what this video is me about. Me and your mom, same was up. Yeah. Anyway, Boy, so. Boy, girl, I'm from the kitchen. Because I've done shows, my friend. Yeah. I've washed. Once I went, it's Chama meeting in the house, my year. <laughs> even if you <laughs> run okay, and go it. somewhere, you'll come back, dishes are waiting on the sink, on the floor, they're there. Or she just <laughs> put. For you. you know those Nokia <laughs> earphones? Kiss 100, <laughs> Shafuweru, yeah. Auma Adel, and yeah. Uwasha. <laughs> just listen you to me. Sing, hey, you sing all those songs, my friend, and just <laughs> wash. Anyway, that was my life. Then, that's when Nessie comes back in my life, and the rest is history. Cause you've, you've had that story yeah. before. If you yeah, haven't, had that story before. just scroll down, you'll find it somewhere. Mm. How but anyway, you know, how I left home, I just told I came to Jammu, looked for her, because most of my clientele now were well, in Kilmani. I'm in Embakasi. I'm mm. wasting a lot of money because sometimes I have a lot of time to kill. So I find myself in town, city star. I order, first of all, I was doing intermittent fasting because it's on a budget. I order, nini, what do you call that thing? That Angera. Thing? Angera. Angera and I eat it for one hour and 30 minutes. Not that it's just to buy time, you know? Just to buy time, you're here with a lemon and you, you time yourself 15 minutes and another sip. <laughs> <laughs> then I go to Kilimani Primary School, do my evening group training, then after that now head home eventually. So all that was just stress. I could not stay at my home. I needed to come near home, I mean come near my clientele area. That's why I went to Jammu. Babu helped me get uh, Babu, Babu the stylist. Help me get uh, an agent, also called Babu. <laughs> but Babu showed me houses. In a, my first house was uh, twenty thousand. Yeah, twenty thousand. It was one house bedroom. Was it was dark. I didn't know whether the kitchen was the bathroom. Or, I didn't know, you know. But anyway, it's the first oh, house. But Jabu is where the, it all starts. I was Jabu happy. Breeds greatness. Yes, it does. <laughs> I was so happy. This is my house. With nothing. I have. My, my, my bedroom, my bedroom curtain was a sugar. sugar for Maasai. Mm. Then for that side was donated by my lovely mother, and sitting room was play was my Bear. training ground. I had my dips for calisthenics. <laughs> then my bed was on the pallets. Even there's one remaining pallet here. For memorial reasons. I sleep there, and I used to lock the door in case anyone wants to steal my three things. <laughs> <laughs> <Your three things. laughs> With my laptop which has a desktop because you cannot survive without being plugged when i was happy it was old i was happy because i remember when you could not watch movies because of that cd yeah. thing you had to buy an external cd hey hey that life was sweet well, for me, no man. it was not let me tell you live in your parents house even if it's a bed sitter you are happy baby eh. any not that experienced it let me tell you guys you understand living alone yani i have my own freedom even if it's a bed sitter that life is nice. nice. Even if you're you're finding it hard to pay rent, I'm not going back home. It's a to up engine. It's okay. And and that almost happened to me by the way. But anyway, that was my life uh in a nutshell. Everything till campus. Now in the next video we're now going to summarize it up and talk about now. Things in her bringing, things in her, my bringing, what makes, where we makes up. Gel and gel where and we clash. Exactly. Simple as that. 
Amen. Now it will make sense. Yeah. Because that is the grand finale of the series. Yes, happening next, next week. week. Thank you very much. I'll come back next week. <laughs> same for time. For always same watching week. and supporting us. God bless you. Don't forget, I'm your coach. Uh, link in the bio. Go Don't to my website. To subscribe. Yes. And come back next week. Yes. And learn something. Like now, this this one will be a serious lecture. Yeah. So if you're awesome. looking into getting married or you're seriously oh, dating, there's a lot. Yes, and also let us know what other topics you'd want us to also touch on. Yes, yeah. in the comment okay. section, it's open. We'll always chat with you. Mm. But anyway, guys, we need to be heading out right now. So we will see you next week. Mashallah! Bye-bye! <laughs>